A fish farmer in Hyangthang village of Manipur is leading the way in fish farming by producing endangered pangba fish. Soibam Surchandra, who owns the Surchandra's Tomba and Sons Pangba farm, today is the largest producer of indigenous pangba fish in the state. Here's a report. The concept of fish farming has brought a revolution in landlocked state of Manipur. One person who has completely brought about brew revolution in the state is Soibam Surchandra proprietor of Surchandra's S. Tomba and Sons Pemba farm, the largest producer of Pengba fish in the state. Apart from supplying the fish in the state, the farmer also exports Pemba and Gatonto to neighbouring states like Nagaland, Assam, Mizoram and Tripura. Kizing <laughs> Having acquired a diploma in fishery science from Mumbai, Surchandra came back to Manipur and took over his family's 11 hectare fish farming business. His farm was established at Hiangthang Mamang Lekai in 1981. He began rearing Pengba in mid 80s. Due to his sheer hard work and utter determination, Surchandra's farm has only seen sharp rise in fish production. His farm has also provided employment opportunities to a number of youth in his village. <laughs> Today, Surchandra's farm produces 40 to 45 metric tons of fish earning an annual turnover of rupees 40 to 45 lakhs. According to him, diseases are the only biggest threat in the fish farming. I farm is him the metric tonji, metric tonji, kuntra the gina. Nipuma bo to one. Kaigno of the kuntra yam yam depressed, give the music kaignodi, not one ping by your podi. I yam and my maximum grossy gram seni so hum. Smile lumen kilumina mari. Oh, <laughs> Surchandra has successfully produced 35,000 kgs of indigenous fish at his Pengba farm. He also rears other varieties of fish in his farm and wishes to rear species indigenous to the state, which are on the verge of extinction. Surchandra procured Pengba from Lothak Lake in 1984-85 to and began breeding the fish species. Surchandra's efforts have not only helped in conservation of the rare species of fish, but have also become a source of income for fish farmers and boosted trade in the state.